Well, nearly six months after a crash in Kalamazoo killed two people, two women are facing charges. The accident happened back in November, and now we're le learning that the driver of one vehicle had been drinking. And 24-Hour News 8's Danny Carlson was in court as that driver was charged. 24-year-old Carrie Braley is charged with three felonies, and if convicted of all of them, could face a maximum of 35 years in prison. Police say she had a blood alcohol content of 0 .09, when she lost control of her vehicle and crashed. It's that November 18th crash, police say, where Braley lost control of her car on this curve, rolled it, and ejected two people, 23-year-old Trevor Stuck and 22-year-old Brittany Despens. Stuck, police say, was ejected and then hit by a car. Despens died from her injuries five days later. And you understand your rights? Nearly six months after the crash, both Braley and another woman will face charges for Stuck's death. This was a somewhat complicated crash scene. It required some crash reconstruction, and we waited until the investigation was completed, and then we did a thorough review before making our decision. Prosecutors decided to also charge 23-year-old Margaret Robinson with committing a moving violation causing the death of Stuck, a misdemeanor punishable by up to one year in jail. Robinson was the driver of a second vehicle that police say plowed through the accident scene just minutes after it happened. Prosecutors say two charges for the same death is the correct decision. In this particular case, I cannot discuss the facts themselves, but I can tell you that after a review of the evidence, we felt that there was sufficient probable cause for both individuals to face the charges involving death. Braley is expected to be back in court later this month. In Kalamazoo, Danny Carlson, 24-Hour News 8.